I got cystic fibrosis. See, I've got cystic fibrosis. Hey, friends, welcome. It's uh, February. I can't believe it's already February. This month, or this week, excuse me, we're talking port or pick. For me, I have only ever known a pig line. Um, <clears throat> growing up, I, excuse me, had IVs uh, when I went into the hospital. That was only about four times growing up. And those mostly were through, an, you know, in my forearm or hand or wherever they could find a good place to put it uh, for the week or 10 days. Now that I am older, I've still been pretty fortunate. I have only had IVs now for about six times in the past 10 years. Uh, most recent time was about 14 months ago. And so every time I've gotten them, I've always just had a pick line placed. For me, it's been easier for me to go into an outpatient center near my house. And by the time I get taken back into the room and they place the pick line, it's about 15 to 20 minutes. And then I am out of there. And stays in for two weeks and then the nurse, the home care nurse, pulls it at the end of its use and it's gone and I don't have to think about it anymore. Uh, I am still fortunate enough that I do not need IVs a lot and my arms still have <clears throat> pretty strong veins that they can thread the pick line through and I don't have a lot of scar tissue build up from multiple picks yet as they sort of bounce back and forth between each arm <clears throat> uh, when I've needed them so that they can still get it through. Uh, in fact, actually this last time was the first time where they had a little bit of an issue with scar tissue, but were able to push through it and still place the line. I've had a brief conversation a couple of years ago about a port uh, when I was having IVs more frequently, uh, but ultimately we decided that for now, um, the best thing for me was a pick line. Have a wonderful rest of the week. Thanks for listening this week. I will talk to you next week when we talk about knowing when it's the right time uh, to call a doctor or your doctor or your care team about when you're sick or having CF issues. That is a hard one for me a lot of times, so I look forward to talking to you guys about it next week. Take care. Have a good week. Bye-bye. I got cystic fibrosis. See, I've got cystic fibrosis.